position. Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll give you the I'll give you the word picture. Um, yeah, I've got I've got a test coming up in in, in four weeks' time. Okay. Um, so I'm I'm at a trained level. Okay. Um, yeah, my instructor Bob, who's gone off playing golf today, but he has got the same car as you, so that's why he sent you along. So I'm familiar with the controls. He said he's going to look at my judgment of speed and my um, general rod positioning. Okay. So my name's Tony, so I'll leave you the meet and greet. No okay. any questions. Hi Tony, nice to meet you. I'm April, oh, I'm going to be your Hello, instructor Hello April, how are you, right? Yeah, you? Yeah, you're better looking than Bob. Oh, thank Not you. Not much, but just a little bit. <laughs> um, I'm going to be taking your lesson today, because right. your instructor's off playing golf. Yes, yeah. Um, and I understand... Do you play golf? No. Don't go for that. Um, so I understand you've been using a car that's similar to this exactly one. Exactly the same, yeah. Okay, yeah. so you're familiar with the controls yeah, and the clean, setup. Yours is cleaner than his, though. Okay, that's good then. Um, so you're, we're going to be doing judgment of speed. Yeah. And our road position, general road positioning. Yeah, exactly my general road positioning. Yeah. Okay, is there anything um, you feel you're aware of? Um, uh, I, I, I think I'm doing really well. We've been, been running through all the subjects and I've been... I mean, spot on. There ain't a speed issue then? For no? No. Not that you're aware of? Okay. There's going to be money for our rope for you. Okay. And um, positioning, any anything um, that you struggle with or anything no. you want to ask me no. before we... No, we've learned to drive for eight months now and I think I've just about nailed it. Okay, right. Well, that's um, get set and we assess oh, you well, on the move and see, yeah. see what's going on. Yeah, before, so, before we pass this test. Okay. I'm really comfortable. Mirrors all good. What can you see? Which one? Exteriors. Um, I can see uh, the, the hollow's back window with mm -hmm. the top and bottom. Okay. See a bit of my head restraint. Yep. And uh, I can see see the corner of your window. Okay, good. Um, I can see the door handles. Yep. I can see the sky coming to the top and the road in the middle. No, okay. same with that one. Sounds good. Okay. Yeah. Yep, very good. Yes, please. <laughs> right. Turn Stop. Left. Turn in left, please. So slow down at the junction. Stop. Stop. Yep. Can we see here? Have you checked? Oh, I'm okay with junctions. Pardon? I'm okay with junctions. Okay, but we need. You're going a bit fast. On the approach to the junction, he's yeah. going very fast. Right, so we need to keep that speed right. down. We've got a crowd behind us here, so I'll turn right and put it okay. in the corner. Just went that mad man. Okay. Yeah, what way on this subject there's two ways I can play it. Right. Yeah? I only let her play play it two ways, but I can only pick one of them. Is this exam on two ways you can do, yeah? Yeah. It's either too fast or too slow. Too fast or too slow for the conditions, yeah? Yeah. Um just give me a specific get your speed down to ten mile an hour now. So, so you should get bring your speed down time now. Ten mile an hour now. Okay, okay. Yeah? Yeah, don't forget, there's no good saying slow down a bit or speed up a bit. Yeah, because a bit is what? It's a bit. It's a bit, isn't it? It's a bit just... Yeah, yeah, your bit is that bit. Okay. Mine, mine's, mine's that much, yeah? It's a speed down to 10 mile an hour now, yeah? Right. Yeah, we were going to do a blind bend there, weren't we? Yeah. We didn't run messing around there, did we? Yeah? Yeah. Right, so... Right, Tony, we'll work on that speed. Yeah, so, so we need to be travelling at appropriate speed for the conditions. Oh, right, yeah. So what do you think would be an appropriate speed well, come on. for this road here? Maybe yeah. we've got a T-junction there. Well, I haven't seen the road yet, have I? Yeah, so going to the analysation uh, properly, what, what's the speed limit for this road, Tony? What's the speed limit for this road, Tony? Oh, 30, isn't it? 30. And is it safe to do 30? Do we always have to do 30? Yeah. Uh, turning right. Turning right, please. Well, I don't know if I've ever been one of these um, uh, uh, doddery old gits, do I? No, it doesn't mean um, if it's 30 you have to travel at 30. It's what's appropriate for the road conditions. Okay, you can have parked cars either side. Yeah, so how far can you see into this bend, Tony? How far can you see into this oh, bend, Tony? Can I see as far as a silver car? Okay, so round the bend, if you can't see, you need to come off the gas. And then when it opens up, you can come back on the gas. Yeah, so you, you, you have to pick an appropriate speed. So. So this is an appropriate speed. Which is 20. 20. Yeah. So it wouldn't be safe to do 30 here, Tony, because... You can't see around that bend. And what can I not do if I can't see? If I can't see, I can't stop it. 
I've got a bit of stop in this don't seem to be clear okay, yet. Okay, yep. yep. If I've got a bend, I don't know what's coming around that bend. It could be pink yeah, elephant. So slow. Yeah? Yeah. So we're going to turn right. Right at the end of the road, please. So come at me again now when we get into this new road and ask me, what's the speed limit for this road? What's the speed limit for this road, Tony? Yeah, <laughs> be patient, woman. <laughs> Doing them together, road position, right. and that at the same time, you could do like. Yeah, I, I won't mess around as long as you're, as long as you're working there. Okay. Right, so what's the speed limit for this road, Tony? What's the speed limit for this road, Tony? Oh, uh, 30. 30. And what would you say is an. What would you say is an appropriate speed, Tony, for uh, this road? Well, I've seen there a lot of room this time, haven't I? So 30, um, would that be appropriate? Yeah, at least do, yeah, we get yeah. near 30, couldn't I? Yeah. And what would be the appropriate speed now, Tony? To come off the gas a little yeah, bit, I'd say on. like 25 to 20. Okay. Just because there's um, yeah, instructions yeah, each side. Yeah, yeah, try and get me to... Uh, get you to answer. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. okay. yeah, you want to find out where the gaps in my knowledge are, aren't you? Oh yeah, because you're part two. So. Yeah. What would you say is an appropriate speed for this road now, Tony? What would you say is an appropriate speed for this road yeah. now, Tony? Well, I won't go very fast. There's a lot of pedestrians around, isn't it? Yep. So he would just deal with that, yeah, like you do. Sorry? He would just deal with that because it's not to do with this yeah. subject. Okay. Now, is it the door of a car open there? Is it? I need to clear it. Maybe. And we're going to turn left. Left at the Yes, I wouldn't have got a chance to do more than 15 there, would I? No. Too much happening, wouldn't it? Um, I can't see here, so I don't know what's coming around that bridge. Okay, so what would be oh, an appropriate see. speed now? What's the speed limit for this road? What's the speed limit for this road, Tony? Oh, 30. 30. So what would be an appropriate speed? I think I could do 30 here. Yeah, it's quite open, isn't it? You can see well, it. Don't give me the answer. Ask, ask me how I'm working out. How, how can you work that out, Tony? I haven't got any parked cars, have I? No. I can see well ahead. Yep. But I can see well to the sides. So I could stop at this as I was to be clear, couldn't I? Yes. To the sides and ahead. So what's the speed limit now, Tony? Oh, 40. 40. Is it safe to do 40? Is it safe? I think so, yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. yeah. Round about left. At the roundabout, turn left, please. What's more now? What's the, what's what's the, speed, the speed limit, limit on this road, Tony? Oh, 40. 40. And is it appropriate to do that speed, 40? Yeah. Is, um, and, uh, why okay. is it safe yeah. to do that speed? Nice wide road. Okay. Um, got no parked cars. I can see well ahead. I can see well to the sides. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we can... I can, stop, I can see that. I can stop it at this as I can see it to be okay. clear. Yep. So Perfect. I'm going to hand that back to you, Tony, now. But I'm going to keep an eye on it. I'm going to hand that back to you, Tony, now. But I'm going to keep an eye oh, on it. Yeah. Tony, what's your position for normal driving? What's your position for normal driving? Oh, about a metre from the curb in the middle of my lane. Yep. Why did you come into the left end, Tony? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
so she wants to be, I don't know. Then. You don't know the judgment yeah. of your normal brain. So I don't even know that I'd be in the gutter, do I? No. Yeah. So, a way of you judging it, Tony, you could use the car ahead if there is yeah, one. Yeah, I'd be living careful to don't get me to follow the cars ahead, yeah? Okay. Because you can use track lines yeah. um, on the road as guide, and you can glance in your mirrors to see where the lines yeah, are. Yeah, come on, you're not really going out much, much detail about track lines, eh? The track lines um, in front, as you can see on the road. Yeah, what do I do with them? You can use them as guide, you want them on, in the middle of your car. Oh, right. They have a little detail, isn't it? They can. Yeah. yeah, you want them in the middle ones next oh, to the right. car. Checking. If I check those two mirrors, I can see I'm an equal distance, yeah? Yep. Very good. And what's the, uh... What's the what? Yeah. What's your position for normal driving, Tony? What's your position for normal driving, Tony? Oh, uh, the middle of my lane or I'm meeting from the curb, isn't it? Yes. And what's the consequences, not? What's the consequences? Oh, uh, if I'm too close to the curb and uh, I clip it, I could go up on the curb. Okay. Kill a pedestrian. Yep. I suppose you might, I might even get your function, wouldn't I? Because I see loads of bits of rubbish and nails there. Yeah. So we don't want that, do we, Tony? No, because I wouldn't like to see you out there sweating, changing the wheel, yeah? Okay. Oh, by the way, if you get a puncture... You I can't change it, no? I know, I know you're female destructive, but don't expect me just because I'm a bloke to get a puncture <laughs> and change the wheel, yeah? I know how to change the wheel. That's good. <laughs> None of this equal rights business in here, yeah? Your car, you mend it. It's your car? Right? Eh? It's your car, uh, you mend it then. Uh, bro, uh, you done it. Wait, you you mounted the curb. No. Nah. <laughs> you allowed me to mount the curb, didn't you? Oh my god. No, not yet. Eh? Not yet. Dark at six o'clock. It's not dark. Sorry? It's not dark. It's getting dark now, isn't it? No. <laughs> <laughs> Are you in an argument with me or what? It's just a dull day, isn't it? It gets dark. The days are longer now. Which is about all. No, I think we had summer yesterday. That's mm, it, we're doing that. We know, we know suntan this year, April. No, hopefully. You have to bite the bottle. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Definitely. I think it's just loot on my fault. Okay. I think it's just loot on my fault. Oh, no, we're in St. Albans. It ain't like this in, um, in Staines. It's nice. Nah, it's worse. <laughs> you got all those airplanes chucking all that smoke and smog out. Oh, God. Oh, you got an airport loot as well, what are you complaining about? Is that busy, that airport? Already yeah, it's quite a busy airport now. 
Have you ever flown from there? No. Nope, just Heathrow and Galway. You know, like, people park up the curb, you know sometimes, like yeah. on one side, you're not obviously allowed to do that ever on your terrace. Yeah. Ever, ever, ever. <laughs> Would he ever tell you that? Like, yeah. no? Yeah. Okay. And that's a stupid question. Why are people allowed to do it then? Because I have to. Well, some roads now are actually marked off with, um, I know, some roads in Luton. the spaces, isn't it? Yeah, the where, where the space actually goes onto the curb, obviously that's allowed then, yeah? Yeah. Um, well, no, they go, you know, pavements for pedestrians, isn't it? Yeah. Lights left. Left at the top of lights, do you? Positioning. Where should you be positioned here, Tony? Oh, I better meet you from the curb then. Okay, um, and we're not doing clearance, though. Eh? Okay. We're not doing clearance, so. And what, what are we doing? General driving position. Yeah, general. General road positioning. General general road positioning. What and and this comes into it, yeah. And judgment between. So why do you leave that big gap? I've made a big gap. That is some big gap. Tourism and tarmac. Well that's far. Why do you want to pick on something that I haven't done wrong? <laughs> hmm. That's well, that's some big gap. That is. Did your mum never tell you if it ain't broke, don't fix it? <laughs> Sorry? No, I ain't heard that saying. That's some big gap. It's tourist and tour, mate. Someone pull in that gap. That's really big. Oh, God. I'm for you to just please you, yeah? <laughs> you I happier now? I doing it for the thing. You happier now? No. That's a bit too close now. Oh, yeah, you see, yeah. Now yeah. the themes are going to come in. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, up and event your side, yeah? Is that true? I never knew that. Now we're going to turn left. What? I know that the themes can come in. That's like only on old cars, isn't it? Yeah, well, cars don't put, put as much fuel nowadays, do they? Yeah. Mess their old cars. Have you ever drove a car with a choke? Say? Have you ever drove a car with a choke? Yeah. That's annoying. Well, they've all got chokes, haven't they, of some kind, but they're all, all electronic automatic, aren't they? Yeah. Well, you're all got, got, got a choke? No. <laughs> I have a joke with my dad's old one, though, and um, a stag. That's not a choke. Oh, that's great. the first thing in the morning you put the choke in slightly your stalls yeah pull it out too my much. dad scares me he's like yeah, you can flood the engine yeah the traffic yeah it's like you can flood the engine or whatnot was he a dad who got you interested in cars um, yeah I like them anyway you know that when I was younger I just yeah. wanted to pass I drove before I passed and stuff <laughs> so that's you going to get arrested now no off road. Oh, off road. Private road. Pri perfectly legally. <laughs> and we're going to turn right. Right, at the next junction, please. End left. At the end of the road, left, please. It's good for meeting around here. Okay. It's good for meeting around here. Oh, I'm really good for meeting. Yeah. I'm not bothered about the moment. <laughs> Come on, I think you've seen the falls, you're just frightened to see it. Okay, well you didn't check your right mirror before. Mirror Mirrors nothing really to do with your subject, yeah? So why do you not check it then? You mirror's just couldn't be bothered. Okay, mirror's right. Normal roads, positioning. Positioning. And what else? Judgment speed. It's got a good hesitancy as well, isn't it? 
when yeah, you abrupt... stopped at the junction. Well, when you abrupt the junction, do you come up and stop in the gear you're in, put the handbrake on, and get the gear lever and good shake and then go in the first gear? No. What do you do? You get the gear change before oh, on right. the approach. So, so why are you not why are you not saying it if you don't see me do it? Forget. If you if you can see that I'm doing something that you didn't do in your part two, yeah. then you probably know you probably know I'm doing something wrong, yeah? yeah. Don't forget the subject is it's covered hesitancy, isn't it? I thought I didn't know it was the right it's covering hesitancy, yeah. Yeah, I'm telling you that. Yeah, we did have a chat about that earlier on, didn't we, before we went on, on camera. Mm. Where I said to you, the subject They've changed the name. Well they haven't changed the name. Mm -hmm. It is actually called progress hesitancy normal rub positioning on the paper on paperwork. But they introduce the subject as judgment of speed and the general rod positioning, yeah? Okay. That makes it more confusing. But yeah. Okay, right, so hesitancy. You could have done yeah, it on so the approach was, and been ready. Yes, yeah, so what, what kind of hesitancy was that? Um you you done everything last minute when you was at the it's junction. Like, like preparation, wasn't yeah. it? So I should if I'd been prepared properly there, I would have been ready to go prepare to stop and ready to go, yeah? Yeah. And what's the consequences of me? And me holding off other road users. Yeah. Yeah, what's the consequence of that? They may be impatient and overtake and then cause a collision. Yeah, exactly. They get frustrated, wouldn't they? Yeah. So how are you gonna work on that on the next one then? Um, I'm gonna prompt you right. on the approach. Three subjects. I think uh, I think it's quite an easy subject. You don't, you don't. Yeah. Okay. Now from the roundabout, we're going to be turning right. At the roundabout, I'd like you to turn right, please. Right. So now we're going to think about what. Um, Actually, you're going to change your mind. Can we go straight on? Yes. Let's go try and avoid the rush hour traffic. Go, Tony. Got opportunity. Yeah. Uh, Hesitancy. You wouldn't say every junction you you know you roll it the first gear. Yeah. It's the appropriate gear, isn't it? It's the appropriate gear. Because if I had an open junction, I could be rolling it the second gear, couldn't I? Yeah. Okay. And we're gonna turn left. Left at the junction, please. And you're gonna talk me through this. Okay, so get your gear ready, Tony. What gear? No. Alright, can we go? Oh I I knew where to go was was that, was that a bit slow getting the gear again then? Yeah, I should have told you earlier. Yeah, it's roughly where should I get the gear? When you're at the right speed first. Yeah, what, 10 car lengths away? One and a half car lengths?